Jerry J. is your old Palmer Jerry's here. Welcome to Q&A number 10. For our 10th edition of Question and Answer, I've decided to bring my mom on board. Hello! Oh, <laughs> oh geez, this is going to be a funny one. Um, we actually played video games uh, the other night. Had a good time, so I figured, you know what? You wanted to be in more videos, why not bring you on for a Question and Answer series? You ready? Yes, I'm very, very ready. Alright, so I asked the Twitter to tweet me your questions using hashtag AskJuggerMom. And you guys delivered some goods, so I'm going to be reading off the computer here. I'd prefer you not to look. I can't see. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that answers anyone's question. Does she have uh, vision problems? Apparently she does. Um, so I'm going to read these and pick these at random. You don't have to answer some of these questions if you don't want to. But uh, just, you know, go for it and so people can get to know you. Okay. All right, our first question is uh, from Maddie. What three words would you use to describe Jesse? Three words. And don't hold back. Um, sensitive. Okay. Lovable. Oh. And passionate. Extremely passionate. All, all great answers. Wow. All right. That's spoken best from a mother, so. All right. Why did Jeffrey and Jesse always fight? I don't know why they always fight. That's a good question. Um, rivalry, uh, jealousy. Jealousy or what? I have why, no would I be, idea. why would I be jealous? If I knew the answer to that, then maybe I could fix it. Why would I be jealous of Jeffrey? What, what, does, he, what does he have that I don't? I don't know. I mean, why Why do you fight then? I don't know. He's, That's more he's like a question he's for really, you he's and he's him, not me, because I have no idea. He always provokes me. He just messes with me. That's why I fight back. I, you know, I always react. It's just he does shit to me, so I do stuff back. That's just how it is. Yeah, well, why I don't... Why do you think we fight? That's Turkish Hammer wants to know. I have no idea. They're your two personalities clash. I that's don't know. Actually, that, that's probably it. That could be it. All right. We're hopefully, hopefully these questions don't get any more tense. I don't want... Yeah. I mean, me and Dad did this before, but... All right. Um, I think I skipped over one. How, do, oh, how does your, seeing your family flip out affect you? I'm just, they're just random. They're random. Like I said, you don't have to I answer. I know, them, but I mean, it's like, you know, how do you think it affects me? I don't really... I don't... I mean, I always get sick. I feel sick. Physically sick? Because my stomach, I get a knot in my stomach. I get very, very nervous. I'm not a confrontational person. I don't, I don't like people hollering at each other. And it gets me upset right, just right, talking yeah. about we're it. I don't just, want to okay, talk about yeah, it. Yeah, we were going to go over it. All right, what were your thoughts when you first found out Jesse wanted to become a professional gamer? Did you support him? Yes and no. I I didn't know what it was all about. Um, but you know? but I trust I trust you. So like I knew that if you thought that you could do something with it, that you would be able to do. You know, you would be able to figure out what you can do. Were you confused? Because you're smart. Was I confused yeah. about? What yeah. Is, what is well, that? I don't know anything gamer? about it. I don't know. I mean, I know you said that you know there's people who go to tournaments, mm -hmm. and I know you got you and your friends went to tournaments. That's true, yes. But as far as making it be a career, I I didn't know that you, that was possible. All right, that's efficient. Uh, what is your main job, or is it just making clothes and stuff for the Etsy store? My main job since 1979 was, um, it's, it's a canvas shop. And what does that mean? The, like we make truck covers, boat covers, just like all miscellaneous cam canvas items and stuff. So I do all the taking of the orders, um, billing, counts payable, a lot of numbers, all the recording. Stuff. Yeah, I do all that. So you don't actually now, make the stuff. You I don't physically? actually. The only time I sew is like if we have a really big order of, um, you know, like 500 curtains that mm. have to go out, then I, I will help out. But um, no, most of the time I do all the clerical stuff. And the Etsy store, we just started that um, in April. Mm. Um, so, and I, I do take care of all the paperwork for the Etsy store. And that was pretty much just like. the post office. I had an opportunity. I, you know, people came to me and just when you going to sell t shirts, when you get merchandise. I didn't know what to do for that, and then my mom was like, oh, we could do it at the shop, and I was like, you guys make canvas. And then we surprised you, because you had no idea that we had been already 
like yeah. working on it, you know. I mentioned it to her, and then next thing you know, that one day I went, I think I was staying at Uncle Larry's, I went to work, and the next thing you know, you guys had print presses or whatever they're called, and they had shirts. Oh, it was crazy. Yeah, it was pretty, pretty um, If you could be a superhero, here we go, which one would you be? That's a good question. Ooh, soup. Well, I really like Harry Potter. I know it's not a superhero, what? but. <laughs> Harry I like Potter, Harry Potter. Yeah. He's really not a superhero. I know, but he's a he, blue had, wonder. He, he can cast spells. He had an inv invisibility cloak. But he's you not know, a superhero. He, could... he doesn't have any powers. He's just a kid with a wand. I know, but he just stood for... The boy know, who lived. lived. He was, yeah. I, you want to be Harry I just, Potter? I love the whole wi oh, wizardry man. school and everything. Wizardry? Yes. How old, oh, how old are you? Like I said, I, you don't have to answer any questions if you don't want oh, to. Oh, I'm, I'm proud. I'm 53. 53. There you go, guys. People were saying all sorts of things about you. Really? You know, yeah. They probably don't want to know. No. Why does Jesse? Uh, why does Jesse have to pay rent but not Big Brother or Jeffrey? JT? I... That's a fair question. Yeah, well, it's not that I can answer that. That's... My husband has a whole different way of thinking, and JT has a job, and he doesn't see what you do as a job, and we go back and forth about this. I used to type the bills up. Yeah. I don't type right. them anymore because he knows how I feel about it. I think it's irrational. It, it, what he says does not make any sense to me whatsoever. So, it's not. It, I don't think it's fair, uh, but it's his house. It's, you so know. it's because I don't have a conventional job? Right. What do I... He sees it as you're not doing like something, you know, meaningful, like, you know. Meaningful? Well, you know, physical labor or um, something where you're working uh, right. like six to six. Right. Or, you know, it's just like. He's kind of old school. Oh, stuff, no, I know? know. I know. You ain't telling. I, just, I know all this stuff. You're telling them. So it's pretty much, if, if, you, if you hate it, then it's a job. That's yeah. his thought. If you hate it, it's a job. Well, well that's freaking stupid. Would you play more video games with Jesse? Asked Dr. Uh, Batflash. Of Flash. course. Yes. yes. You would? Yes. I really enjoyed um, playing. Well, I didn't play a lot, but I did kill three zombies. You did? Mm -hmm. Yeah, actually. You know. Yeah, it was fun. I liked it. How was Lawrence, <laughs> Uncle Larry in parentheses, as a kid, and was he a nice brother? Me and Uncle Larry, we are one year and a few months apart. Oh, that's it? I yes. And we, we were always, I mean, we had fights, but we always were pals growing you up. You guys hung out together? And we so? always, and my sis, my, my, I have two sisters, but my one sister, um, she's only a year, well, there's a year between all three of us, so we were always together. We always had somebody to play with. Um... Is that because you're Uncle so Larry, close? Uncle Larry ha always had my back. I had his back. Is that because you're close in age? or? I think so. I mean, I have one sister named Jeffrey, and we don't get along like that. Well, there's three, oh, more than three years difference in right. you guys. Maybe so that's what I it don't is. know. Or maybe it's just I think it's guys. personality, too. Are you proud of Jesse for how far he got just by playing video games and doing YouTube? Of course. I'm very proud of you, Jesse. All right, I'm not getting mushy on the Q&A. Not today. Not today. How do you feel about everything um, another one of these that your husband does to Jesse? Didn't we already go through this? This was, yeah, they're just random. I'm just pulling randomly. I'm just going through. You don't have to, I mean, yeah, you Yeah, I mean, it's you it pretty much um, the same thing. I, you know... I don't, it makes me sick to my stomach. What is your favorite movie slash TV show? You can give one of each. Movie. This goes back to the favorites powwow. How do you pick just one? I would say movie has to be Green Mile. I approve this message. Um, television show? Television show. Oh, God, there's so many good ones. It has to be lost. Nice. Lost. Definitely getting my approval. Yeah, That's all you had to say. Okay. That's it. That's good. After having two kids, did you ever think on having another one? Jessie was a difficult uh, pregnancy. So, no, I couldn't have another one. 
Uh, um, You're saying I ruined it for everyone? Well, I was in bed with you for two months. What? Yes, because you wanted to come out early. What's up? <laughs> no, but in between, I lost, I lost a baby. I had a, a corneal ectopic. And, What's uh, that mean for those who are... I had um, a pregnancy in my tube, and then when it grew, it burst open. So I uh, lost a lot of blood, and they had to repair it and everything. And that was a year before I got pregnant with you. And that's why I had such difficulty. Because you technically you. already had an in-between kid that didn't grow in the right spot. Exactly. And then it caused problems for me. Yes. And then what? You, what about after that? After that, I they didn't so advise me. They, did, they, they didn't really want me to have get pregnant with you. you Good thing high, you did. You were high risk. <laughs> high risk for So, show. yeah. Then after, I mean, I could have went for the third, but it probably would have been really dangerous. So. There you have it. There you go. Prolific. Good question. Staring contest. Go. Oh, shit. Ready? Just go. Are you just looking at one eye? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Keep it up. It's hard when you don't... Ah, uh, fuck! I was already going a long series of not blinking because I was trying to read... Uh, <laughs> I just got beat by my mom. <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. I, I just teared up. That was pathetic. I think it's because yeah, I did. You didn't last very long at all. That's what she said. W all right. Kira was... Kira asked... God, my fucking eyeballs are burning right now. Kira asked, was Jesse a kind and sweet child or rambunctious and random child? Two question marks. Jesse was a sweet child. And... Goddamn right. Yes. And then... But then when... Um, I, I'd say more into the teenage years, you had, um, so he had severe mood swings, really, and it's fair enough that we had to get, um, take you to the doctor and get some referrals for you, for your, um, condition. I mean, everybody, everybody gets referred, it's, we don't, we don't need to go into that shit. Do you did, oh, oh, fuck, do you think Jesse's dad deserves a name, psycho dad sometimes, and why? Um, I understand why he's called that. He has a short temper, but I do think it's disrespectful to say it to I'm, his face. Yeah, and what about, you know, just calling it, calling him that, you know, in video or something? Well, it, as, as, I don't know. If you, it, what, you don't it, agree? Well, it's a little disrespectful. It is. But I mean, I can't, I mean, that describes him. I mean, that's how he is. No? You don't, you disagree with that? Well, I don't know Did that. you not dress him as the Hulk for Halloween? Well, I mean, that's why did you dress he him has as the Hulk? He has a temper on him. He doesn't, I mean, he's psychotic? irrational and he has a temper. And that sounds like psychotic. But I don't know if, if, I don't know. Alright, I mean, do you think he deserves it then? No? Because it's disrespectful? Is that? Well, it could be something else. This is a joke. This is a joke. Anyway. Yeah, it could be good. something else. Can you buy Jesse a Wii U and play video games with him more often? I swear I didn't write that one. Well, yeah, I told you I'd play more video games with right. you. Uh, as far as buying another Wii U, we'll have to see. If need. I don't know. Maybe? Maybe. We'll see. If, if I'll let you play it. If you're good. I'm good. What did you first think when Jesse told you he was doing YouTube as a job? What did I first think? I think we already kind of had a similar yeah. question like this. Yeah. This. Well, not well, why. You know, I support. I support Jesse, but ever he does. Typical mom. Are you still grossed out by two girls, one cup? Oh my God! Yes, I will never ever you watch still think that about again. That? You still think no, about that? No, but I will never watch that again. I wouldn't expect you to really, but. So you're still grossed out? Like you still, oh, it's disgusting. Can you still visualize some of the... No. Well, I know what happened in it, but... Please, go into it. No, I'm not going no? into All it. Right. Kind of keeping with that theme, Aiden asks, why is there a toilet in your garden? Hey, you smart. Could you see that question? Huh? Could you see... You can see that, can't you? No, I'm thinking about that Two girls other... up and that makes you smile? No, it's not that the it hell? makes me smile. It's just that that is a silly question. Really? Uh, what do you think about it? I guess. 
I guess. Why Maybe is there that to- person never saw it. Focus. Why is there a toilet in your garden? Seriously. I, I asked that personally. Like, why is there a toilet in your garden? Well, it's gone now. Is it? But, I didn't notice. Yeah. Um, why was there? That didn't make sense. Just because we were changing out toilets. And then so you Barney, put it in the garden? Barney, our yellow lab, passed Old away. Yeah. And we didn't have a tombstone for him. So, not that he drank out of the uh, toilet a lot or I anything. Did but, um... Dogs do drink out of the, I mean, our labs drink out of the toilet. I get it. So it was a so we, for we, Barney. Yes. Wait, he was and buried under that garden? Yeah. Oh, I'm yeah. learning stuff from Q&A too. How do you feel when Jesse's dad destroys everything? There's a lot of these, sorry. I hope this question gets featured, by the way, huge fan, says Calvin. I pretty much think I said all I want to say about that. Okay. What career did you want? As crazy klutz clutch. Did I want? Oh my goodness! Growing up, I wanted to be all different things. When I was a teenager, I wanted to be a veterinarian. Oh. Um. I loved horses too. I did enjoy um, in 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 middle school. We used to put on um, puppet shows. Is that what you're about to say? No, they were kind of they. Wanted to be a puppeteer. It was called a spring concert. I used to play the flute. We used to. Uh, I used to be in a jazz uh, dance group we would perform on stage so, be so i kind of like wanted i i would musical i love that kind of stuff so yeah i think i think that's what i should have done i think pursue but i got caught up in the family business with pop ah, canvas yeah pop-up started it if you were to vacation anywhere in the world for two weeks where would you go and why if you're going to pick two weeks i'd imagine you want to go somewhere that's also a developed country well, you know, well, where did they film Lord of the Rings? That was in New Zealand. Because that was beautiful. That was in New Zealand and some other Australian places, I think. I wouldn't mind going there. You go there. there for two weeks? Is that warm? I don't know. I've never been. Down under. I'm sure some of you guys would know. Yeah. You want I think maybe I'd like to try that place. Yeah. All right. There yeah. you go. What is the best moment you remember having with Jesse? Oh, gosh. That's a good question. Recently, I mean, Whenever. I can remember. First thing I can remember a lot when we were. Uh, What's like the first thing you think of that really just stood out and was like get a good time? Or it was just the other night playing The Last of Us. Um, Dang, you remember the name of the game? Wait, really? Yeah, that what was, was like a... that was like the best moment that we've had in a long time. We haven't had, we haven't had good moments. Um. It's been a, it's been a few Dang, years. I didn't that's, realize it, it meant so, that much. So, yeah. G Juggy, oh nice. Or George the Juggy as how do you feel about Jesse's job as a YouTuber? Well, okay. We kind of had this. Yeah, one. we kind of already have. I, mean, I think he's kind of talking about more current, currently, or just recently, because it it has become more of a job as I've gone on. It seems like. Yeah. So how does it? Well, I th I think it's good, but um, I also like you know you have the camera all the time and it does get a little bit. That's well, yeah, that's the job. Yeah, I know. I understand that. I'm just saying, like for for me, you know, and then things that happen get on you, you know, for everybody to see, and that's. That's that's YouTube though. I mean, I understand that. It's and... just that sometimes I feel like it's that an invasion I... of our privacy. So... so I should stop doing my job. No, no. I I'm not saying that. I'm just saying that you know he, George is asking. I mean, we're how... the videos on right now. I know, I mean, but fine. this is you're different. Fine. This is different. Why? Because is... we agreed to it. We knew we were going to do right, this. Right. Exactly. And mm. then and this isn't like you know private stuff. You know, okay. family issue things All right, that I didn't happen. Know that. That's cool. That's fine. What's your favorite thing to do? My favorite thing to do is dancing. I love to dance. Mm -hmm. I love country line dancing. I love What's that? just freestyle dancing. I just love it. Country Especially line? to a band. I love bands. Country line dancing. You're all doing the, like the same steps. Like square like there's dancing? A 30... No, it's not square dancing. It's like you know, there's grapevines, there's, um, there's basketball turns in it, Bas which is pivots. Because I know basketball turns. 
Totally understand now. There's shuffling, there's um, sailor steps. It, there's a lot. Some of them have like 64 steps and you have to... It's also good for your memory too to remember all these dances. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Really? A woodchuck could chuck as much wood as a woodchuck could chuck wood. Damn. Dang. You're familiar with that. That's that... been around forever. Oh, yeah. And I'm surprised. I wonder who brought Nico the Reptile. I wonder how old he is. Because that's something, like, we, I, I'm familiar with that, but that's not something that's been really prevalent, you know, around, like, our age. Like, yeah. that's not something we say to each other. Like, we, just, we, just, <laughs> we just say, these nuts. To tell you the truth, <laughs> I think, um, I think Mama, Grandma and Papa came up with it. Had that in their age, too, I think. Like, when we Probably. Were growing that up. sounds like something it's from been around back in the day. Oh, here we go. Thanks, Jane Andrews, for asking this. What was Jesse's most embarrassing moment as a child? Okay. You did poop your pants. I mean, every, but every I wasn't, kid shit But themselves. I wasn't there, so I didn't see it. But every I'm, kid I pooped their up, pants. But I'm sure. That's why diapers exist. But I'm sure you were embarrassed. No, I actually, believe it or not, that's why you said that. That was, I shared that embarrassing moment with them as mine. I, I was older, that's the, that's the key here. I was older, and I, like, outside of diaper age, I was like 12 or something. Well, it's... And I shit everywhere. I think also you've also shared other embarrassing moments, too. Maybe. Like, when, when your, when your dad ran over your video games and you screamed... That that was that was pro that was probably the most embarrassing. But you weren't a kid. Is it? Did yeah, it's a kid. It's a, it's a kid. kid. But thank you, thank you for bringing that up. That was yeah. Well, that's funny. What I'm talking about embarrassing. I came, no, yeah, things. I came to you in confidence that you know you wouldn't share it. I mean, yeah, I mean it, when it started taking off, when everybody saw me screaming, I mean I had to just kind of own it. Right. Well, you're I mean, not embarrassed about it now, are you? I'm embarrassed you fucking bring him back up again. Um, Young Buddha asks, do you like your son still living at home? Actually, yeah. Yes and no. Explain. Elaborate. For both me and the Juggy's sake here. Well, I love, I love to have you, you know, because I, 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 I just don't want, I don't think it's a really, oh, how long am I going to say this? Yeah, how are you going to say it? What are you trying to say here? I don't, it's not the best thing for you. To what, move out? No, to stay here. Yeah, I mean, I'm aware of that. I, I mean, mean, I, I love having, I love having you. I would, you know, I just, the environment. Well, I'll be out in January, so. It's not conducive. It's just, oh, I know, I don't know, you, you actually kind of wanted me out, but. I don't. No, I know. It makes sense. It makes it's sense. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. It's cool. Here we go. Keaton asks, hey, that's my picture. What the heck? Do you believe Do you believe YouTube is a job? Uh, whose side are you on? Just, you kind of, we know how you think YouTube is a job. Yeah. Let's call, cover that first. Why do you think YouTube is a job? I didn't know that you could do YouTube as a job. What makes it a job now? Because you're making money. You're making money. Ah, that, that's perfect. I'm so glad you said that because that's my thought. If you make money at it, it's a fucking job. No matter what it is. If you make money at it, you could be just like... I don't even... I was trying to think of a ridiculous excuse. You make money at it, it's a job. Alright, so that's, that's yeah. good. We but as that. far as sides, I'm not on... It's not like there's sides. Yeah, it's sides. A, well, it says who's starting on Jesse or... Or Dad. It's like, I... Well, in the respect that I think YouTube can is a job... Right. Then I guess I would be on your side because... What about then just generally? Who's side, who side are you on? I don't like to pick sides. I mean, I feel like you should. I, mean, I, you, have, I you should have an opinion. I do have an opinion. I think YouTube is a job. I told... No, just like generally. Do you agree with me or do you agree with Dad? On what? Just everything. You can't just say everything. You have to say which thing you're talking right. about. So you're just going to not... Like, if you say, as YouTube being a job, he thinks no, I say yes. Okay. Why he thinks no, I don't know, because you're getting paid. So, I don't know, I don't understand his thinking. Well, if you had to pick one or the other, you'd pick but me that's or him. your if side. If you had to pick one or the other, me or him, who would it be? Over what? Just, what if we were both hanging off a cliff, who would you save? Oh, I would save you, Jesse. That's the honest truth. 
Because I'm younger. I would die for either for either of my children, actually. Shit just got real. All right, we're gonna move on. Louis or Louise asks, "Would your mom ever do YouTube videos?" Actually, it has five uh, five parts on there. That's five likes. They used to be stars or favorites. Five from likes there. from. I don't know. There's just, just as many people like the question. Oh. What if I? What would I? If I would you ever do YouTube videos? Which technically you're doing one right now, so. Yes. I would do them for Jesse, or like if my brother wanted me to do one, to be in one. But, oh, but I don't want have... to have my own. No. You wouldn't have your own channel? No. I'd have to learn all of this stuff. That's true. I don't know any of this stuff. You can't teach an old dog no trick. Well, actually, you can, because Uncle Larry learned now. Hmm. No, you wouldn't be interested in that? I wouldn't have time for, for that. No, that's fair. <laughs> Why do you so let weird. Jesse's dad be so controlling over the rent issue? Don't you have some pool? Why do I let him? That's you don't have to answer that. Yeah. But I mean, what? I mean, that's a that's also a good question, though. I mean. What would? Oh, he does said that he asked me if I have pool. Yeah, I mean, because I mean. He no. Because he, char he charged husband, me for. I mean, you know, he charged me for. Your father does not listen to me. I was at. Um, I got charged for a fire hazard for lighting off the fireworks, in the morning building. Did you know about that? For, what do you mean? Did you, On Halloween when I love the fireworks. Did damage to something? No, I, no, I didn't. No, I didn't damage anything in there. He just charged it because as I'm, like, I'm, I don't know. I don't know why. It was like an insurance policy. I don't know. But like, if why don't you have some pool? He's asking. No, I have it? no pool. I, if I had, if I had pool, it wouldn't. You wouldn't be char charged rent at all. Really? <laughs> what? what I about? have no pool whatsoever. But you're. A, I know that's very sad, isn't it? This is really kind of getting me depressed. I, these are questions that kids are asking. Will, I appreciate your question. Um, I hope I hope it's answered sufficiently. Uh, Crystal asked, has Jesse and Jeffrey always been this way towards each other? Yes. Okay, wow. Yes. You guys used to fight like cats and dogs all the time. Just two dogs. And when... when when my mom, when grandma used to watch you, right. she would always, I remember, always tell, telling me that she had had to tell you guys no physical contact. Accurate. Accurate. Because you guys, it, it, it would be... We usually the, ignored her. It would be the littlest thing Actually, no, Jeffrey would, would ignore her, and I'd be like, yeah, listen to grandma. Or I remember when a thunderstorm would be coming, she'd say, uh, turn off all the electric. Oh yeah. Even even She's before petrified. even before petrified. the electric goes out, we had to turn it off. So no matter what, there was a storm happening. It didn't matter if the things got knocked out or not. We had to knock it out ourselves. But anyway, that's totally rambling. So we've always yeah. been this way towards each other. Yeah, always. I mean, Do just you remember. I mean, gosh, I mean, when you were three or four, Jesus. there could have been things that were done that I didn't know. I mean, there's you stuff know, I probably repressed. I don't remember. I mean, I just remember getting my ass beat a lot and then coming to you guys. But uh, most of the time, you didn't. Just, you didn't. Um, I feel like we were more physical then. I mean, granted, Halloween we got a little physical, but I feel like we fought more. Yeah. I know. I can remember you would actually write things down. Mm -hmm. I have to look for them. You would write things down because we would punish both of you. You'd be fighting. Bullshit. And we would punish both of you because we wouldn't know who was, was telling the truth. So we just punished both of you, and then you would write me long letters, as like a almost kind of like a lawyer, like like a and you would Jimmy, have this, the defense, this, this. the defense, and the the how good how man. Come it was. Jesse was a good unfair. man. Unfair. Yeah, smart. He's a smart ass dude. I have them somewhere. Oh, I want to see him. I'll feature him on video. And Enon Enon asks, what was the worst fight you've ever gotten? I don't want really to answer that question. Why? Do you on. answer all the other ones? Because it's it's really none of their business. Redneck Firework asks, how do you stay so neutral between everyone with all the crazy stuff that goes on around you? You guys are I drilling think we're gonna these questions. I have some more fun questions. The, um, there's some in there, I'm sure. Uh, everyone was really, everyone's really trying to get to like the meat of it. How do I stay neutral? I feel like we're having another fucking therapy session. I don't know. 
know. I think it's the only way I know how to react is to be, you know, I don't know. I'm a scared little girl at heart, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. Now, see, I know. Now, I'm getting... All right, we're getting to the... Yes, okay. Oh, this is the last... It's the last question. How did you react when you found out that YouTube was going to be a full-time thing for Jesse? We've kind of explored this, but yeah. just, I guess, for fantasy tube's sake, what's the final thought on when you found out YouTube was going to be full-time? What was the first thing that came to mind? I think it was great. I thought it was great. I still think it's great. I, so I, whatever, whatever you want to do, whatever makes you happy, nobody has the right to tell. It's your life. So... Whatever you want to do, and just do it. Just do it. Just do it. And and nobody, I don't think anybody has the right to tell another human being that you they can't, can't do, that. do that. That's a great you end can note. Do whatever. That's a great end note. Um, that's good. You guys can do whatever the hell you want. I think I've proven that I I could have I could do YouTube. I mean, I've been changing hearts and minds. I still have to get my dad on board. Clearly. Um, but yeah, that's that's true. You can do whatever you want, and nobody should ever tell you that you can't do something or you're not good enough to do something. Um, that's a great message to end on. Well, thank you for doing Q and A. That wasn't so bad. I mean, no. some of the questions were redundant, and some of them were a yeah. little invasive, I guess. Were next little... next time, maybe we can have some more fun ones. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I was just that's just what people gave me. I was, yeah. was crazy. I was reading some of them. I was well, like, I know yeah. they were curious. Yeah, because they but, they don't know you that well, so yeah. they want to get to know you, and that's I think that's the best way is to get real serious and deep. All right, Jays, don't forget to subscribe for more content. There's some links in the description. Don't forget to subscribe to Jeffrey because he's just great in all ways. Um, I was just what well, I have to I have to do that. I have to. I wasn't being sarcastic. I know you told me that the was, other night. Yeah, that's just that's why I have to do that. Um, all right, Jason, we'll see you guys uh, next time for another Q&A. Yeah. Maybe my mom will be back for a future video. Maybe we'll play some games or something. We could do a Let's Play. I don't know. Anything's possible. Uh, would you just say you enjoy yourself? Yeah. Yeah, I, I, cool. yeah I'll do it again. Now, it's a shame. Now, they all know you, but you don't know them that well. Isn't that kind of... Doesn't that suck? All right, Jason, that's it. You know what my closing is? I love you, Jason, to death. And don't the forget... Keep, to keep it, it rigid. rigid. That's... Yep, yeah, that's right. <laughs>